Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hello to our dearest lecturer Dr. Brian Ravin and to all our beloved scholars. So today our group are going to share to you guys application of ocean biology mimicry where we choose a product derived from Venus flower basket sponge. Venus flower basket sponge or Euplectella aspergillum is a marine organism that found in the Philippine island, the western Pacific Ocean and the Indian Ocean. It lies in the deep water from 100 to 1000 meter depth which is in this spotting zone where light cannot reach. The most important thing is their cylindrical skeleton are made out from silica to adapt in the deep sea environment. The Venus flower basket is suitable as our model for biomimicry innovation to create a safer motorcyclist helmet because of its behavior that can withstand high pressure while living in the deep part of the ocean due to their skeleton with tough and stable composition. It has a skeleton with square lattice slat structure that is reinforced by the struts that run vertically, diagonally and horizontally which help the sponge resist against sliding, buckling and twisting force. The sponge glass skeleton is made from spicules. The spicules are layers of colloidal spears of silica this helps the sponge to have the most stability and good flexibility. This characteristic helps in absorbing force and high pressure resulting in strong and tough sponges. There are two principal mechanisms of injury to the brain caused by motorcycle crash, which is through direct contact and through acceleration deceleration. Injuries that result from either contact or acceleration dislation injuries are divided into two categories, which is open or closed head injuries. Open injuries involve a fracture or penetration of the skulls that may result in brain injuries. Closed injuries do not penetrate the bones of the skulls. They may occur as a result of an impact which jar the brain in the skulls. The movement of the brain within the skulls may result in bruising, swelling, tearing of the brain tissues, nerve or blood vessels that resulting in the brain concussion. A helmet aims to reduce the risk of serious head, neck and brain injuries by reducing the impact of the force or collision to the head. The injuries in head and neck can cause death, severe injury and disability among the motorcycle users. A helmet helps to reduce the deceleration of the skulls and hence the brain movement by managing the impact. The soft material incorporated in the helmet absorbs some of the impact and therefore the head comes to a halt more slowly. This means that the brain does not hit the skulls with such great force. It spreads the force of the impact over a greater surface area so that they are not concentrated on particular areas of the skulls. It prevents direct contact between the skulls and the impacting object by acting as a mechanical barrier between the head and the object. The inner part of the full face helmet can get very hot and limit the airflow in the helmet during the hot and humid weather. This environment factor can cause high temperature and high humidity in the helmet and may decrease the efficiency of the expanded polystyrene or EPS form as short absorption material. This might cause a severe head injury in actual crash. The full face helmet is thick and heavy that may cause discomfort to the user. The helmet outer part is made with thermoplastic they are thicker and heavier but cheaper than the fiberglass material. The inner part of the helmet is made with various material that has shock absorption mechanism that can be quite heavy. The heavy helmet may give an easiness situation to the user such as head age, neck pain and can cause problem especially when you turn your neck. This may break the neck during the accident. The full face helmet may be pricey for the user, 
The varying prices of the helmet is because of the material used has better quality, less weight, better ventilation, and additional features that look more appealing than other type of helmets. However, both of the cheaper and expensive helmets have no differences in safety terms order that has been approved by the authorities. To solve the problems related to the full face helmet, we come with the invention using mimicry of the Venus flower basket structure to our helmet. First is to mimic the sponge squares with diagonal reinforcement structure as the impact absorbing layer of the helmet. The structure is known for its flexibility and high strength to weight ratio is applied to absorb the impact during accident. The structure raises the distance and time it takes for the head to stop and decrease its acceleration during impact. The layer will compress and distributes impact across the helmet to prevent severe head and brain injuries. Next, by implying the structure, we aim to reduce the materials used in the helmet's manufacturing because of its poor structure and thus lowering the manufacturing cost. Lastly, we mimic the sponge's porous structure to make the ventilation system for the helmet to provide more comfort. This is to direct cool and dry air into the helmet and spread across the helmet. The warm and damp air will be drawn out from the helmet and the visor will also be not misting up by applying this ventilation system. The challenges in making this helmet is first to choose the best material to construct the sponge structure for impact absorbing layer. The material is vital for providing the absorbing feature that we wanted. Next is the challenge on how to place the sponge structure itself in the helmet to provide the most benefit out of it. And lastly, the wind tunnel posi position on the helmet to provide the best ventilation system. Our product design is shock absorbent full face helmet. This is all our design objective. First objective is material reduction. Expanded polystyrene EPS will be reduced due to the squares with diagonal reinforcement shape is being applied. The second objective is wet reduction. Outer shell is the first layer where carbon fiber is being used that's similar to the spine. Material used in impact absorbing layer is expanded polystyrene EPS. The third objective is increased strength. Impact absorbing layer is where the squares with diagonal reinforcement is being used to mimic the spine skeletal structure. This layer is helped to reduce the shock during an accident. The last objective is giving comfort. The ventilation system draws warm, damp air and direct cool dry air into the helmet. It also put the wind tunnel on the chin bar of the helmet with couple of vents. Next, the overall design of the helmet. Here is the front view, back view and side view of the design. This design focuses on durability, ventilation and the absorption of impact. This is our outer layer design for full face helmet. First is outer protection layer. Next is face shield. And lastly is lower face protection. For the inner layer design, we would like to focus on the inner absorption layer. 
So this was inspired uh, by the skeleton of Venice flower basket sponge as what my friends mentioned. It has a diagonally reinforced quality like structure. So this can absorb force and high pressure. So even after impact, okay, uh, we can lessen the impact because uh, it can reduce the shock during the accident. For the accessory design, we have enhanced safety visor with polycarbonated tinted plastic visor. It is a changeable visor holder with a 150 rotational swivel. For the ventilation system, we have airflow intake hood ventilation on the upper side of the helmet. Next, we have middle respiratory ventilation and last but not least, the respiratory ventilation for the mouth. For the conclusion, we would like to conclude that these product features for both inner and outer layer are human's need and can lessen human impacts after accident. We assure that this quality product can be logically invented and compulsory to be used in our daily life.